hello and welcome back to my channel it is july and this summer so far has gone by so fast i've been kind of busy um but in that time i've actually found quite a few things to declutter as well as I have quite a few empties and some of them were pretty exciting. So I'm going to start with my declutters today and then we'll move into my empties. And I have a variety of things here, like so much. So first thing that I have is I have this scarf, um, which I got from my sister because um, she was going to declutter it and I don't think I've worn it since I got it. So I can declutter that. And I have this scarf as well to declutter um this is one that i impulse bought and then i really haven't worn that much and really haven't been wearing scarves as much in the last couple of years so time to declutter those then i have this blue like cardigan style sweater um the sleeves are just too tight and it's just kind of getting a little like dingy looking I guess and I just don't wear it anymore so um that can go um then I was we were working on cleaning out our storage room which you will have seen already and in one of those boxes I found a nude leotard from when I was in dance like a decade ago so this can be decluttered I don't need that anymore um next I have this long sleeve top. Um, the sleeves are just a little bit tight um, and it just doesn't fit quite right so I never wear it so time to let that go and somebody else can get some use out of it. And then last for clothes I have this orange floral blazer like soft shell blazer. Um, it's super fun however I just never wear it so time to let that go even though I love it I think it's beautiful and fun but time to let it go because I don't wear it and I'm really trying to I guess downsize my closet but also trying to like curate it into things that I actually enjoy wearing and then being able to wear the things that I love more frequently so that's all the clothing declutter and I have some more I have this headband, it was just sitting in a box. Um, I bought it when I was studying abroad in China. I don't wear it and I really don't have an emotional attachment to it anymore. I think that's why it was in that box, but time to let this go. Um, next, I have two of these like um, bracelets. I forget what these are called. Um, they're two, again, found them while I was going through boxes in our storage room. Don't have any attachment to these and I will um, donate those and somebody else who enjoys wearing that kind of bracelet can um, enjoy those. Next I have a lanyard. Um, I'm, I think this is a lanyard from when I was um, in Texas doing a program with NASA. Um, over a decade ago or around a decade ago so um, we can let this go it's just a plain blue um, snap away lanyard um, next unfortunately this pen I don't know if you can see that but there's still like ink left in it but it for some reason like the top dried out um, so it's not working anymore um, and I love these pens so unfortunately I have to declutter that um, then next thing to declutter is this is a um, like screen protector cover for my Apple Watch. Um, as you can see, it's pretty beat up, so it's time to change that out. Um, so letting that go. Um, next for declutter, I have this bouncy ball that I had in a pocket of... <laughs> one of my um jackets and then every time I put that jacket on I kept finding and I'm like okay I need to actually declutter that now last thing for declutter kind of random but I have this rock that's spray painted chrome um I don't need a spray painted chrome rock I'm gonna go leave it on the like sidewalk 
kind of by where our neighbors are. They have some young kids, so uh, maybe one of them will find it and think it's cool and give it a new home and a new life, but I don't need it. So that's everything for my declutter. Now on to my empties. Um, first off on my empties is I have this Mainstays Alpine Forest candle. It's burned all the way down. All that's left in here is um, just a little bit of wax, but the wicks burned all the way out. So that candle is done. Um, I think I can recycle this. And I'll just clean it out. Um, so that's an empty. My next empty is I have a lint roller um, that is empty. I've had this lint roller for a very long time, but finally used that up. Next is the new, new um, screen protector for my Apple Watch. This is just the packaging from it, but I used up the screen protectors from this. So I'll recycle the pieces that can be recycled. Um, next, I have this mini um, OptiFree Pure Moist contact solution. Um, on things of repurchasing for my empties, I always forget to do this. We have like four more lint rollers, don't need a new one of that. We have tons of candles, we don't need any more right now. And I actually have some more screen protectors already purchased, so I don't need to buy any more of that. Contact solution, I think we have a little bit of a stock, so I don't need to buy that right now. Um, next I have this Top Care Everyday Sport sunscreen. Um, spray sunscreen. We have a ton of sunscreen, um, so do not need to repurchase that right now. Um, then I have this Vichy HA Serum um, sample size like mini that I got in one of those like sample packs. Um, this was fun to use for a while, but it's just not something that I see myself using consistently. So I probably wouldn't spend money on it, but it was a pretty nice product while I used it. The next thing I have is the Mrs. Myers fall leaves scent hand soap. Um, I will not be repurchasing this scent because my boyfriend hated it. Um, so we will not be repurchasing this scent right now. I have the Mrs. Myers pine scent like Christmas pine scent or winter pine scent and I like that one better um I don't think he loves it that much I don't think he likes the scented soaps but I like it so we'll probably keep that one next I have the Dawn Platinum Power Wash um I actually already repurchased a new one in the lemon scent and that's what's in my kitchen right now oh a few more things um, then I have the Bobbi Brown Vitamin Enrich Eye Base Sample. Um, this was nice. It's just not something that I see myself needing or using, um, but it's always nice to try out a new product. And then we are on to some really exciting empties because these fall into my Project Pan category. Um, the first one is I have another nail polish. Um, this one is a Clinique one in the color happy um i'm so glad to use this one up because let's see if it'll do it oh yep it did the glue for the lid part um came apart so it's not it doesn't stay together so then i have to like crank or crack it open because it gets stuck and then it was just always a mess so i'm really glad that i used this up um next in my project pan that I panned is the um, Urban Decay 24-7 eyeliner in the color LSD. This is to the point where I cannot sharpen it anymore, so I'm counting that as an empty, um, and that was on my project pan for this year, so I think that went really well. Um, I am working on a, another eyeliner now that I panned this one. It's not officially in my project pan, but it's one of my older ones that I want to get used up before the expiration. And finally, my last empty is the Florence by Mills um, Swimming Under the Eyes gel pads. These were like the little whale ones. Um, these were fun to have for a while. This is just not something I use consistently enough to need in my collection. Frequently, I'm really trying to downsize the amount of extra things that I have. I'm pretty simple 
when it comes to things but it's always nice to try out something new and you know throw something fun in every once in a while so I probably wouldn't repurchase this and I actually um, going back to my eyeliner I already have a backup of the um, color LSD because this is my favorite I love a sparkly blue eyeliner and that is everything for my June um, empties and declutters. I hope you enjoyed and I will see you next time. Bye.